sure why. One more day. Morning, morning. Good morning. Or give me the weather report. What's going on today? Uh, it's a lot colder than it would be back home. But uh, where's home? Bermuda. Yeah. Great race. Great, great weekend. And uh, other than the rain, had a great ride. What trails are you riding today, Wes? Oh, well, we're riding Butter Gap, and then we're riding Davison River Trail, and then we're gonna go up and hit Bracken and come down uh, Bracken. I think we're doing Brushy on the way back in. But yeah, that's pretty much the route today. A little bit of gravel, but it's gonna be awesome. We're excited, oh my God, can't wait. It's gonna be the best day ever. How are you feeling going into this? I'm excited, should be fun. It's a little cold this morning, but otherwise we're good. <laughs> <laughs> Which category are you leading? Uh, 50s, five day. Yeah. And, uh, What's your name? Ryan Matthews. All right, uh, how far are you ahead of seconds? I have 11 minutes today. Okay, so you, you feel safe? Never feel safe, but any mechanical, I had a bent derail yesterday, lost three minutes. I'm glad this is the last day. We'll see. Play it safe. All right, so you, you're, well, uh, what category are you leading? 50 plus. 50 plus. It's my first year in it. It hurts a little bit, but. Oh well. All right, how, how safe are you? How much of a gap you got over second, the rest of the competition going into the final I have day? an hour and 47 minutes over second. Okay, so what's the plan for today with that Just much buffer? No mechanicals. Of course, I'm thinking my tire's like losing air, so I'm gonna check it out again. So, but it should be good and the sun's out. So that's, th day three almost broke me. I almost didn't come back for day two, four. It was, I was in a bad place. All right, what are you doing today, Cypress? Uh, I think I'm hopping in, trying to get a little follow cam from the start today, so it'll be a little, maybe a little harder effort out there to stay with some guys for a bit, but it should be fun. <laughs> All right, so, uh... Tyler, Owen told me kind of secret time last <laughs> night that you were going to take a flyer this morning. How would that work out? Uh, well, I mean, it was working out great. We, uh, every day someone's gone off the front right away, so I'm like, oh, today I'm going with them. It'll be the three of us. We'll pull through on the on Kathy's, get a bit of a gap, and then maybe I can hold it. Um, I tried, look back. Dirt Camp boys were all over it, chasing us down. Then went again, still chased us down, and then Owen finally went over the top of one of the last risers, got a gap, and then I was like, oh, okay. It was hard from the start. Man, I was like clipping in and we were rolling out. I thought it was gonna be kind of nice. And I mean, I looked up and it was strung out like a full on pace line, so. Dude, that was, whew. I guess he th thought it was like cyclocross season already. Whew. I just never recovered from that start effort.
the fun part. <laughs> Especially if you know what you're doing. Buttery, baby. Rotor gap, unfortunately. Ah, uh, smooth. It's nice to have some flow for after all we've been through the last two days. Right? No, thank you. Let's see if I can keep up with this couple.
Almost there. Yeah. Do you know this trail? I do. Is this the last time? It is. and a slice of bacon and a whiskey shot. I had none of those things because I was definitely gonna throw up <laughs> if I had any of them. Right, what do you think of today's course? It's fast, it's fun. It's kind of a nice finish uh, celebrating the whole week. So, and lots of climbing and some fun to say and some climbing in the enduro at the end. So I gotta like it. Are you thinking you're gonna come back to this? Uh, I think so, yeah. I just have to uh, dust off my mountain bike skills a bit more than like three days before flying out. I think, I think you did all right. Yeah. <laughs> By the end of the week, yes. And we had a good sprint at the end, but we almost collided. So, right, so how did it end up? Uh, Carson won. <laughs> all won, that work, and Carson right. still won the stage. Right, so you, and you still took the over. Yeah. yeah. We were all within like two yeah, seconds. Yeah, it was a sprint to the finish. Yeah. You were third or Yes. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. <laughs> good week. Yeah, I guess we did. We kind of failed that. Carson still won. <laughs> Damn it. Yeah, so I got the final stage win at right, least. So how, how many stage wins? Two. Yeah, two and five. So. And second overall. Second overall. Yeah. They made it hard. It was so good, and all the ladies this whole week, they were just such a good sport. It's amazing for female riding because me and Teresa yesterday, we went back and forth for almost four hours, you know, three hours, 40, 45 minutes, non stop. And she loved it, and I loved it because we pretty much emptied the tank. So uh, today, that's why it was hard. That's why probably I didn't have that much on the climb that I should have. But yeah, I'm so happy. <laughs> I had a, a tough day out there. I was a little, a little beat from uh, pushing really hard yesterday. Um, we were going back and forth yesterday with Vieta and had a good day, so I pushed really hard on the gravel climb, and then today I really just didn't have anything else in me, so it's kind of a bummer, but um, I think I ended up fourth in GC, and um, this is my first stage race, and I had a lot of fun. I definitely will do one again, so. <laughs> it was really hard, but I'm happy. This week was probably the hardest thing I've ever done, so. Uh, I started out hard, <laughs> but it was really cool, and I'm really excited to do it next year. It was yeah. awesome. Yeah, it was fun. It's fun, mm -hmm. like, honestly, the coolest part, uh, the race is cool, but doing it with your child and, like, just watching her excel and, and trying to, you Just, know, like, helping each other. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah, and, and she was gracious enough on the, the climbs to wait for me at the top, and which is nice. I mean, uh, well, so. you, were, you were gracious enough on the downhills to wait for me. Fair enough, fair enough. <laughs> Did you come in from Peru? Yes. Yeah. What brought you in? Uh, I have a friend that raised this uh, Pisgah race a few years ago, and they told me it was insane. I have to come. Did it live up to the hype? Yeah. It's insane. So good. All right, so, so you ended up second. Yep, that's where I am. <laughs> <laughs> right. Oh, boy. I'm not good at interviews. I'm sorry. 